The Soybean School on RailAirCulture.com is brought to you by High Stick NT, Cruiser Max Beans, and Pride Seeds. So we've had some decent rains finally. We went through one of the driest periods and in, in actually since 1965 is what they're saying now. So that's 47 years that it's been since we've had that much dry weather. Finally some rainfall. Lots of people asking the question, is it enough to do any good? Is it too little? Is it too late? Is it saving the crop? What's happening? We're standing here by a soybean field. You can have a look at this field and you can obviously see that in, in this field there are spots that are done. It just isn't going to help. So there's some soybeans here that have been totally defoliated from spider mites. You can see that the plant's really trying. It's got some new trifoliates coming, trying to feed the, the pods that are left, but there just isn't enough leaf tissue there. It's not going to be able to fill those pods. So in this particular case, it really is kind of too little, too late. We just, uh, there's better spots in the field though. So if we walk out to some of these greener soybeans, we might see a little bit of a different story. And as we move out, so out here, now you can start to see that yes, in fact, these, these rains in, in this particular spot in the field are, have the chance to help the yield. We now have some pods, some late blooms and some pods that are going to set a, t a cluster at the top of that bean plant. The, the so spider mites didn't get a chance to take the leaves off of this particular spot in the field. So we still have some leaf tissue there. There's moisture now. We have a shot at actually getting those beans, bean plants to fill the pods and have a little extra yield there.